Hi all of you, we are the Destiny Girls, and we are improving our behaviors and redeeming ourselves just like the Molly Gang. We are really furious about the Storm Rangers and the Genesis Warriors behaviors. We never thought that those guys would become delinquents to society. Here's the truth about the Storm Rangers and the Genesis Warriors. First off, they always become whiny crybabies over everything, betraying everyone including the Spectrum Girls and other groups, always bringing their baby creatures with them, attention seekers and so much more. What the fuck? They are just Mary Sue's and entitled Karens about how they behave. Next up, Kevin, Lewin, Jenny. Laura and Tony claim to be the so-called smartest people in the world and never let others like us and other people win. Just because Penelope is the smart person, that doesn't mean she isn't smart enough as much as them. She always mess up, and people always make mistakes like her. And speaking of smartest people, Samuel and Walter did the exact same thing like Laura, Tony, Luan, Jenny and Kevin do, like claiming they want to be smartest people just like them. And we all heard from multiple people that they along with Jenny, Laura, Tony, Luan and Kevin that they all learned that they absolutely have no more sense of purpose unlike me of whatsoever. That's the truth about the Genesis Warriors. And I know this is actually getting over with, but when two of the Storm Rangers members who go by the name of Tracy and Jonah called us Destiny Girls bad names and the Molly Gang object head terms and brainwashed us, those terms are getting way out of control until 2022, and they want to cause trouble to us and even to society. Thank God those object heads ended last year, considering why they should actually be on the naughty list this Christmas. But seriously, the Storm Rangers and the Genesis Warriors all need to be blamed for this. And to start the worst part that my autism and I actually want to put up, is that Lance always uses autism as an excuse and he is also the so-called richest man in the world, considering why he is the next Melody Amble, Crystal Moral Bucks and Cecile Bernard in town. Wow, that is the disgusting thing my autism and I have heard. Not to mention that he also acts up and has mental issues unlike me and always bawls, screams and shrieks over everything. And there are a few words that if all of us realize this, but did we know that Rosalina, Carolina, Marisa and Trisha are becoming psychopathic delinquents that they along with the other Genesis Warriors and the Storm Rangers also known as the Ranger Squad attempted to attack and kill our baby siblings. That's despicable and horrible. Like seriously. The Storm Rangers and the Genesis Warriors all need to be put on Santa's naughty list and then get cool on Christmas days permanently for everything they did which was outrageous to everyone. They lied to us Destiny Girls, the Molly Gang, the Spectrum Girls, the Dish and the Vent Girls and other gang members. How could the Storm Rangers betray us and everyone for no damn reason? I thought we were good friends with them, but no. They always become delinquents to society. When will they ever learn to act like normal people like us would? Probably not. I mean, what the fuck has gotten into them, and we all hope that they will rot in hell for the rest of their lives behind bars, get disowned by their family members and never set foot to us, or to any of our family members or to everyone ever again. So, remember this all of you? The Storm Rangers and the Genesis Warriors are psychopathic low-life entitled Karens and Mary Sues with no sense of life and purpose who went as going as far by becoming delinquents. We're glad that we cut ties with them, because their behaviors are really getting out of balance. And to all of you, do not trust, forgive or support the Storm Rangers and the Genesis Warriors because they are nothing but spoiled bastards. We're not gonna lie about it. They are nothing but entitled Karens, Mary Sues with no sense of life, etc. And if you all like the Storm Rangers and the Genesis Warriors, we all would highly suggest all of you to permanently cut ties with them and never support them, ever. But until then, this is the Destiny Girls signing off.